For those of you that don't know what Plex is, I am going to create this short video just to let you know what Plex is and how it uh, makes your Xbox One a true uh, media hub for your living room. As you can see, I have the Plex apps downloaded. Uh, you can go to Plex.tv, sign up. You do need to be a Plex Pass member in order to um, view it now. It will be available later for free download for those of you that don't want to join up for Plex Pass. But as you see here, it lists out all of your content um, automatically will download thumbnails, movie information, organize it um, based on top or recently added, top movies, uh, so on and so forth. So when you click on a movie, it'll bring up the information, year, actors, you know, uh, general information um, about the movies. Like I said, all of this stuff is automatically scraped for you using the web player. You can add custom content. So as you can see here, I have game videos. Um, I can go in here and watch the Division trailer from E3 this year that was recorded off of my uh, Xbox, as you'll see as it comes up here. Um, but it is a really, really good app. Um, it's a really good piece of software. I've been using it for a number of years on my Mac to organize all of my uh, content as far as my videos just as when you get a large library it can be a little daunting to keep up with it but as you see plays back fine um easy to you know come out of what you're looking at and let's see if i can show you one last thing here if you go to movies hit browse and you get a listing of all of your content like i said um, posters for all of your movies so that they're easy to go through and find. If you, you know, decide to click on a movie, again, you get the description of what that movie is about and click play and you're off and running. But it's a great app if you got a large movie library. Um, it definitely is at home on the Xbox One considering all of the media features that were promised for the Xbox One. So check it out if you get a chance.